and another big concern, getting around, especially for those without cars or buses. But what do you think of the political priorities in the countryside? Write to us at Election Desk, Country File, BBC Pebble Mill, Birmingham B57QQ. Or if you'd like to email us, that address is coming up at the very end of the programme. We're looking forward to hearing from you and to having your company at the same time next Sunday. Until then, goodbye. Born free, only to be gunned down by poachers. Next week, how the venison on your plate could be from the black market. And on Mothering Sunday, a golden crop for farmers, daffodils. In the wrong place at the wrong time. Someone wants revenge. Everybody's getting over this except for me. Leave me all alone. No! Make it easy for both of us. I'll go away when they release you. Stories from an open prison. If she says he's pursuing her, hustling her, and he is. You've got some opposition on the outside. The meat may inherit the earth, but they don't get special privileges round here. A question of retribution. Insiders, Wednesday, 10 o'clock on BBC One. That Hugh Gatsko is bound to create mayhem in the Labour Party. Howard Wilson has become a byword for political dishonesty by seeking to preserve old Labour. James Callaghan killed it. Three insights into three Labour leaders by one of the country's most respected political commentators. Brian Walden gives a series of lectures on Gateskill, Wilson and Callaghan starting tomorrow at 11.15 on BBC Two. Now on BBC One, Michael Hazeltine goes on the record with John Humphreys. Good afternoon. Can the Tories recover in time for the general election? I shall be talking to Michael Heseltine and suggesting they can't because their strategy has failed. And what of the Liberal Democrats? Is Labour about to do for them too? And will any of it really matter if Europe ends up deciding how we're to be taxed? All that after the news read by Jenny Bond. Good afternoon. The government is to investigate claims that patients at Broadmoor Hospital have too much influence in its running. The inquiry to be announced by the Health Secretary Stephen Doyle follows the discovery of pornographic videos. It will examine the role of the patient's counsel. Prison officers welcomed the inquiry but said it should be wider. Broadmoor High Security Hospital in Berkshire contains some of the country's most dangerous criminals.